here with Branson Crawford in 2026 catch out of Gainesville. Bran uh, Branson, I appreciate the time. Thank you for having me. So we're here at the Underclass Games Showcase environment. Um, some guys can get a little bit amped for a situation yeah. like this. Other guys just see it as a chance to go show what they got. How do you mentally approach something like this? Um, I'm coming out here to showcase my talent and yeah, just show all these guys what I'm about. Some big news out of Gainesville, Chris Carpenter, Micah Owings, a couple yes, former big leaguers are now at, in the front of that program. Tell me uh, what that was like for you guys to, to know that that was going to be who was at the helm of things. It was really exciting, really looking forward to next season. I feel like that could really impact how we play. What was their message to you? I know that they set you guys all down when they took over. What, what yeah. did they tell you about the future of the program? They were just saying how they were going to make a difference and hopefully you know, make it deeper, like into the playoffs. So, yeah. Obviously, really some important. some guys that threw a lot of big league innings. You being a catcher, what do you what are you hoping that you learn from guys that have had that, that kind of experience? Um, I'm hoping I just learn like how to compete better. Um, I they've obviously been around the game for a long time, and I just feel like they could help our pitchers out. So I'm really looking forward to that as a catcher. When a guy's developing as a catcher, there's so many things you got to deal with, right? You got to learn how to work with a pitcher. You got to control the run game. You got to call a game. Just so many different variables. What do you feel like is really a strong suit for you right now? Um, I feel like I have definitely developed my hitting aspect. I feel like I've developed some power and. Um, Getting better at pitching, that's what I'm trying to work on right now. What about behind the plate? I mean, what do you feel like as a catcher, um, this is what I, re I do really well? I feel like my arm strength is definitely my strong point. Do you are, do you like it when a team's like, we got to test this guy. Yeah. I want to see what the arms Yeah, I love that. Yeah, because then I get the opportunity to throw him out, and that just changes the game. All right, so you had a successful high school season. Uh, what is a, what does a successful summer mean for you? Um, looking forward to, you know, going deep into some tournaments. Um, Definitely hitting better like I did in my high school season because last year I didn't hit so well for travel. That's what I'm trying to focus on right now. All right. I want to have you kind of show us what you, how you do what you do. So we're going to have you yes, get sir. your bat and take us through your swing. Sound good? Okay. Yes, sir. All right. So when I get in the box, I tap each side of the plate, make sure I'm good up to the plate. And I start with like an open stance. I'm pretty tall. Keep my hands high. And usually I get a fastball outside. That's what normally pitchers start me off with. So I'm just looking for something early to drive. And if they come inside, I just turn and burn. And then if I get like two strike count, I get like probably their best pitch was just like a curveball or something off speed. So then I just like spread out and I'm just getting my hands to the ball, driving something oppo. Branson, man, thank you so much for doing that. I appreciate it. If not already, make sure you follow Lake Point Sports on all our social media channels. Hit that subscribe button on YouTube and you'll get so much more happening here on campus.